Hello, for the week number seven, the topic is opinions and factors. The objective is that students will learn to interpret information and differentiate opinions, facts, and information. To start, we need to explain children what is the difference between facts and information and then give them some examples. We can tell them like uh, an opinion is when a person shares what they think or how they feel about a topic. But a fact is like the general truth. So we can give them some examples like, I like cats. That could be an opinion. But if I say uh, cats have four legs, that could be a fact. Then if you are working with the youngest children, you can give them this guy and read out eight sentences. After you read or you tell them each sentence, they color it. So if the sentence is an opinion, you ask them to color it in green. If the sentence is a fact, they ask them to color, you know, the tentacles that include the sentence in red. And when you finish, you compare the opinion octopus. If you are working with the all these children who can read, you can actually give them the Dumbo octopus guy and ask them to read out his sentence and circle the one that is correct, if that is fact or opinion. And then you compare with the whole group. After that, when all of them have understood the differences, we can read the book Mango, Abuela and Me. This is a very nice book about the adventure with the parrot. To finish, we can make groups of four people to play a game that is called Race Track. This game is especially designed uh, based on the sentences, facts, or opinions from the book. In the last part, we are going to play a game called Facts and Opinions. This game is based on the book. So the students will practice their knowledge about facts and opinions. In this case, they can make the dice or they can choose to play with a regular dice, right? Then they have to choose a token, a card. What color do you want? Red. Okay, so you split the group into group of four children. Then each one has a token and they take turns to roll the dice. Okay, so let's say you get one. So you move. So when you reach the blue squares, you read each sentence. Grandmothers speak different languages. Okay, so is that a fact or an opinion? Mm, that's an opinion. Ah, very well done. So you keep there, so you don't have to come back. What if you said a grown answer? Mm, that's a fact. Okay, if you say a grown answer, then you return to the previous stage. Exactly, then the next person continues until they reach the finish part. Thank you.